Hello everybody, this is Out of the Box Unboxing and in today's episode I'm going to review this cordless angle grinder from Parkside uh, available in Lidl and on the beginning my judgment thumbs up very nice tool, very handy very well made and uh, because it has a 3 years warranty definitely I'm recommending this tool and if you're curious about uh, my full opinion stay tuned so basic parameters about this tool is that uh, it has a 12 volt uh, battery uh, lithium ion so uh, you can charge it uh, very quickly very efficiently so it's the same type of um, batteries that you have in your smartphones uh, the capacity is uh, 2 ampere hours uh, other basic features is that uh, no load rotation speed is uh, 9500 uh, rpm so almost 20,000 uh, cutting disc diameter only 76 millimeters but it's very small very compact um, for sure you will find a decent, decent um, way to use it uh, it's uh, for let's say precision cuts not for let's say very hard work uh, it has to be handy small compact so this is what has been designed for uh, charging time approximately 60 minutes this is I think uh, most important parameter after the, 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 the rotation speed and uh, diameter of the, of the blade because uh, you can come back to work very quickly but please also um, take, into consider take into consideration that now uh, Lidl is promoting so-called um, 12 volt team and as you may see it's adding also manual of additional batteries to the uh, package so you can buy actually a spare one spare battery but if you have uh, other tool from Parkside uh, you can also use that battery because they are exchangeable so easy as that you can, uh, you can take away two batteries and uh, you can constantly work one is charging second is in use so no problem uh, it's also claimed to be accessory uh, hex K but I think it's a must uh, nice feature uh, in old uh, angle grinders you you would get um, two keys one for the blocking second for unscrewing I mean this hex but now in those days in 21st century you can ha you have a special button now it's rotating now it's not and you can screw and unscrew easily so very nice feature a small thing but it's uh, um, reducing amount of the equipment uh, could be better if you have this key somewhere here molded into the frame but okay you don't you cannot have everything but I think for the future it might be a very nice feature just to be able to storage somewhere here for instance um, in terms of the uh, build quality, uh, nice rubber, what is good in my opinion that you don't have this uh, rubber on the switch because sooner or later it would be uh, uh, vanished so it's, it's better to have a rigid plastic instead of some fancy rubber on it. Uh, on the beginning I was not able to turn it on, this is a let's say downside but uh, after reading the manual, I was uh, able to to, uh, to 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 over overcome this obstacle. You need to press it down and then forward. Uh, as you may see, it's also not starting straight away. It needs some time to to get uh, the up to speed. So uh, take a closer look in 3, 2, 1 sorry, in 3, 2, 1 
I think it needing like a two seconds, but what is nice feature, you can block the switch and have three ha hands. <laughs> Safety is a little bit suffering, but uh, I think it's a nice feature. Uh, 12 volt team. Uh, uh, until now it was a 20 volt team, now it's 12, so we have two teams, small one and a big one. Uh, another feature, uh, those three lights with uh, indicator or indicator of the, um, the the battery condition. Very good, uh, very practical, I would say. Uh, in terms of noise, I couldn't uh, find uh, uh, sound level, but it's very, very quiet, as you could uh, hear. Uh, barely uh, noticeable, noticeable. So, uh, very good. And yes, uh, uh, last but not least, uh, this uh, black box, black case. Uh, it's not stinky. Rigid, very, I would say, proper quality for the um, uh, for the uh, for the for the money that you are paying for this device, and also nice feature if you have uh, many parkside tools, such labels that has been I think since one year added to the package, are helping to distinguish one tool from another. Yeah. This is my uh, fair opinion, my recommendation is uh, positive, thank you for watching, stay tuned and see you next time, bye!